Hi and welcome to Life is Strange, a game about young lady love and mystery. Which is perfect, because as a male gamer, when I'm not harassing other female gamers in real life, I'm certainly doing something to female characters in-game to, uh, I don't know, reinforce some, some male power fantasy or satisfy my sexual something-something. Uh, but I have on good authority that there is a lesbian sex scene in this game. If you make the right choices. And so, I guess I got no other choice than to embark on the quest for scissoring. I can't believe I just said that. Life is Strange is a story-based game to feature players' choices. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. And wisely we will choose. Because we're on a quest. How do you know you'll be safe at the lighthouse? I don't trust you. Oh, I can't go. <laughs> I wonder what trapped in a storm means. supposed to symbolize that's pretty bad oh my god and uh, that's a creepy thing I guess come on Max you can make it Nice little map. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah. Watch out. Famously called film little pieces of time but he could be talking about photography as he likely was okay i'm in class everything's cool i am okay from light to shadow was, from color it was just a dream skin. now can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black i didn't fall asleep and that Anybody sure didn't feel like a dream Bueller? weird diane arbus there you go, Victoria. So it wasn't Why a dream. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? <laughs> and frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. What am I supposed Seriously, to do? Though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Yeah, I'm looking. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of their beauty or innocence? She had a brilliant eye. So uh, she could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer 
Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. He captured the essence of post-working America. It's not working. I'm trying to pay attention the to the class, of the era. and I'm trying to look at the photo. The you don't have beauty without a beat, which and I'm not... explains why Frank was careless. Oh, okay. <laughs> How can I show this to Mr. My Jefferson? My God. I can hear the class laughing at me now. <sighs> Advanced controls. So it's a pretty photo. And both were the great chroniclers of the 1950s. Well, oh, I understand. We haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Kerouac on the balcony, and if you haven't, shame, shame. Capturing the romantic urban solitude of the 20th century. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? <sighs> it's a little journal. It's nothing bad. Nothing wrong with that, right? Oh, here's some people. Here's Kate. From Lost, there's douchebag teacher, there's me, there's some other lady, then there's uh, the Blackwell Academy, <laughs> then there's SMSs, dad wants something, I'm an, I'm an angry teen so I don't, I don't read dad's messages. Kate wants to talk to me. I don't read mom's messages either. Come, I'm an angsty teen. And then there's Waldo. Don't ignore this message. What? What does he want? Let's bust shit up. Oh my god, go away. Free poet. Okay. Dig. Now. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. And his famous self-portraits are famous early examples of that truly awful word you pesky kids love so much. The selfie. And it's a great tradition, and I wholeheartedly... I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. Yeah, since we're talking about selfies. Sorry, I know. So if anybody wants to question the portrait as modern... I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as I you do. all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, you were asking me? I did know. I did know, but, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? There Louis is no Daguerre try. Was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Wow. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. Here's the thing. You can find out all about him in your textbook. Or even online. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <sighs> Here's the thing. You can tell this game was made for a controller because... Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. My god, is it jerky when using a mouse. Oh my god. Let's take this off. Yeah, okay. I hope this helps. 
Well, now my FPS is like 100 and they're screen tearing, but whatever. At least it's not as jerky. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Yeah. Of course, Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Oh, it's a, it's a camera. Expensive camera. So, Victoria will be very hard. That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. To get him back. Even though I didn't want to be in the picture at all, it was fairly fucking cool to watch him at work framing us. That's a bit pretentious. Apologize for this. But, you know. That settings. printer is amazing. I'd love to see how it reproduces my pictures. I could pump out a whole gallery show with that thing. When I obviously yeah. Blackwell spent bank on the computers here. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Hi, Kate. Oh, hi, Max. You want to be my friend? You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. Hmm, yeah, you want to grab a cup of tea? Although that cross there might suggest that she's hard to get, so I don't I know. I hear that. Want to go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. <laughs> Dear Kate, Urge. we love your porn video. Oh, I was wrong about Kate. <laughs> Maybe you and I can make a video, hey? Oh, hey. This might make a cool shot. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Okay, enough pictures already. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Symbolism. Man, he even has the best plasma HGTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Do they even make plasma? He even has the best plasma HGTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Wow, you're glitching out. Mm hmm. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Smack, huh? Hmm. <clears throat> that, uh,. Was a very unfortunate word. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. Oh, I never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. <sighs> just do it, come on. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a lion. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images. 
to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need I have a is fever. the to share your gift with others. And the only remedy is what more cowbell. From the amateur. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. That's but it. I still dig my little instant camera. How cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying a you Welcome always to the real world. Sounds cute. Hot. Huh. Then I might send you a special picture. Yeah. I feel like you have to Because Max wants everybody to see how pink she is. She plays it so sharp. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. <laughs> Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. Do a couple of lines. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant snake. I like the presentation, it's pretty, pretty nice. Ah, the science room. Here's the portal to Warren's brain. There's Taylor, always waiting for Victoria. I think that's Courtney. She's such a slave to Taylor and Victoria. Ah. Driving a car by the seaside, watching the world from the bright side. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Yes, this poster must stop bullies dead in their tracks. To all of you, American That's Dana talking to I think his name is Justin. No one can tell where your heart is. American girls like Dolly with shiny smiles. Dana is on my floor too. She's such an archetypal gorgeous cheerleader. <laughs> they must make them in a fact. Stella is always deep in her notes. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. Aww. Poor Daniel. He's so nice. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. Do it. I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. Okay. And he's a Vortex Club member. It looks like she's been gone for months. I cry sometimes walking They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. Good thing I left my AK at home. No one could dry her fountain till she got tired. That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. <laughs> Don't need a PC, missed the Poetry Jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. Hashtag save the bay. There's Hayden, another Vortex Club bro. Oh, I can hardly wait to never be too cool like Nathan and Victoria. Lame. Yeah, real lame. <sighs> oh. I don't care about these people. Principal doesn't come out of his office much. How 
how many students ever actually memorize all this shit? I guess we all should these days. Where's the fire exit? <sighs> I don't talk to teachers. Talk to this guy, though. God, Samuel is such a weirdo. But I kind of liked that about him. There's Juliet in my dorm. Yet another Vortex Club disciple. <sighs> Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. Rachel Amber is now, a bitch. Now, who would bother to write that crap? That's not very nice, is it? <laughs> Come on. You can do it. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? Yep. I missed a poster. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. No. When a door closes, a window opens, or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. I hate Victoria Chase. Me too. This poster must drive people to have sex. <laughs> Kate twerks. God. Amazing. Oh my god, look at this stuff. I'm good to flow, thanks. <laughs> Vortex Club? A jerk. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Alright, take the photo. It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I want it, I could blow it up. You're the boss. Yeah, good job, Nathan. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! <laughs> I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. <sighs> Nobody more. would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Oh, Nathan, Nathan. Douche and murderer. Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? It was another I dream. Was in the bathroom, he shot that poor girl. I held up my hand, and then I was back here. 
These pieces of time can frame not in class again. From light to shadow, from color. Now Kate is being hassled again. Mm. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. <gasps> I can time now, travel. Can you give me an example of a Man, I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. Victoria? Why Arvis? Whoa. Because That's cool. I did now, it. Can you get hey. it? We did it. Perfectly I'm captured a human the time machine. <laughs> Anybody? Max, don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition, and Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. I can tell. Your generation. So I can go back in time. Selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? The point Can I save that her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I need this. I need this. I know this. I feel sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows this? Jefferson class? wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process to give portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Mm. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again process, and give him the right answer? Detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular. How long do I need to? Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly won. Oh, yeah. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Shut up, creep. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you're not crazy. You are what do you not mean? Dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. That's not as interesting as that girl about to die. Oh, oh, okay, fine. Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Kate. Um, uh, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just tripping. Too much stress. I know the feeling. Uh... <laughs> I wish we didn't. I have to go. Too much happening right now. No, 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 no. Sure. I want to be in your video. I only want to share whatever gifts I have with the world. Victoria hasn't moved from that spot. All right, all right. Uh, does it say the same thing here? What are you waiting for? Go. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's blow this joint. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Mm. 
I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Dr. McDouche. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. <laughs> Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Press control. Oh, okay. So it's either control or... Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd oh, never let again. one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. God damn it. Thank you. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. 